I'm extremely happy and excited for this uh, new opportunity that this, uh, this deal present to me. And it's an opportunity for me to, uh, um, again, uh, show my commitment with the community and with the people in, in Miami. And bottom line is for me uh, to continue to get better every single year to help this organization get to where we're going to get, which is uh, winning a championship and being in the, on the right side of things, which is, uh, which is winning and winning, uh, uh, winning it all. It's not just making it to the playoff. It's not just uh, being a, just a competitive team. We just want to accomplish something. And uh, I, I definitely uh, seen this as an opportunity for me to continue my, uh, my commitment with the organization, with, uh, with my teammates, with my family, and with the people here in South Florida. So I just want to say thank you uh, to the organization once again for putting the faith on me on continue to be a, 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 a part of this process, you know? Uh, we embraced this process in 2018, right? When uh, Derek, Bruce, and, and the new ownership got here. And uh, I show my commitment to the, the, that I want to stay here. And I wanted to be uh, throughout, uh, throughout the, the whole process that they, they, they've been preaching. So now, more than ever, uh, I just want to make sure that I continue to be the, 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 the rock, the, the build the foundation for this, uh, for this process, knowing that we have a lot of talent. But at the end of the day, my commitment is for me to continue to be a good shortstop, you know, uh, in an everyday basis, and until they, uh, they think I'm the best shortstop for this organization. And even when I'm not the shortstop, I can play every other position in the infield. I can be a good uh, backup player. I can be uh, a lot of things. I'm not asking for, uh, you know, for you guys to uh, be telling me that I'm going to be the, the, the shortstop for this organization for the next 10 years. But I definitely want to be here. And I showed that, um, that interest to, to, the, to Derek and front office early in the year. Uh, we worked through uh, some of the things that, you know, like you always got to talk about what the future is going to look like, uh, what we got in, uh, in, 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 in the future with the organization, uh, with talent, you know, uh, who we got coming next, what are we going to do? And one of the things that I'm excited about is that we're finally taking a step towards uh, being uh, not that we was in a competitive team. I'm talking about the future. I'm talking about the all-in commitment that this organization is going to make. That's one of the things that make my decision even easier to uh, want to stay here, not just for another year, but uh, uh, through 2023. And hopefully we can do some good things so I can stay here for the rest of my career. <laughs> At the end of the day, it's, uh, that's what you ask for. You know, you ask for uh, the first step, which was uh, creating the, 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 the floor, uh, creating a good foundation for this organization to have a lot of prospects, to have a lot of people that, that can fill the roles that, that you see in the, in the, at, at, the, at the field, like the Jesus Sanchez, the Lewin Diaz, the Brian De La Cruz, the Sixto Sanchez, the Sandy Alcantara, that got to this organization in 2018 and, and, and the years uh, after that. But at, at the end of the day, it's like, what are we going to do now to make, a, to make this team a competitive and not just a competitive team, but a, something that can fight for that, uh, for that next step, which is uh, going to the playoff and winning series in the playoff. So I'm, ex I'm extremely excited, like I say, to be here today with you guys and uh, announcing not, not something that is just good for me and my family, for, but for the organization as well. Uh, I want to say thank you to all the, the, the people in South Florida that have been supporting my career since I got here in 2015. I always like to uh, acknowledge uh, that, that moment when I got here and I wasn't an everyday player. I was a player that uh, uh, got the opportunity to, uh, to start my career off the bench, to uh, build myself up into a, an everyday shortstop. Now that I'm at this point of, this car uh, of my career, I just want to win. And, and I want to win here in Miami. So the commitment from the organization is to be all in and be very active this, uh, this off season, trying to get the best players that we can get uh, uh, in free agency trades, whatever it is, plus all the talent that we have. So I'm really excited about that. So gracias a todos los Latinos en la, en la comunidad de Miami por el apoyo que me han dado. Eh, esta, una vez más, ratificando mi esfuerzo y mi gana de estar aquí en, en, en Miami y en Florida con ustedes. Para, para que bueno para que me sigan apoyando y sigan apoyando el equipo en lo que en lo que viene pero quería dar las gracias personalmente y en español para que ustedes sepan que también estoy muy agradecido por la oportunidad